Hello and welcome to the next part of my collection with this nice installment of a new WE franchise. WE 12, I think it's time to show some uh, of my wrestling games. And uh, believe me, there are a lot of them. So, after starting with a newest installment, starting with a good old NES collection, four of them. And none, none of these are very good. Um, this is the first one. I think this was the second one. Now we have steel cage matches. Uh, yeah, but it's not so funny. The King of the Ring uh, is okay. Uh, I think it's um, a step to the um, Super uh, Nintendo Entertainment System games. But these games are just um, a piece of junk. If you are a fan, you can get them, but I don't um, think you need them. So, to the SNES phase. Of course, also for... It started with this famous Super WrestleMania. Yeah, also... Not a great game. If you're, if you're a fan of uh, AVGN, you know this is an LGN game, so uh, you expect nothing. The Royal Rumble is acceptable. That's the first, of course, like the name, the Royal Rumble setting. Raw is um, maybe a good, it's playable, it has nice effects. There's some uh, secrets you can uh, now get a thing, a steel share. I think it introduces first the steel share. Um, it's okay, but it's not so very decent. It's just for fans. And this is a real arcade game, and uh, believe me, um, I don't like it. I don't like it, really. Uh, it was interesting, it's a beat-em-up, but it's not a wrestling game. No, I expect something more. Speaking of something more, talking about Nintendo, so coming to the N64 era. Both games are very decent. No Mercy is considered as one of the best wrestling games of all time. So if you have an N64, these games uh, are needed. You have to get them. They're absolutely great. And I think No Mercy is very good. Very solid. The next things, like the WrestleMania era, if you want to call it. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, I think it's not the right thing. I think it starts with Excite. Um, the WrestleMania games uh, were very good. If you have a GameCube, it's it's okay. It's not the greatest thing on the living planet, um, but it's okay. Uh, you see The Rock, you see Kurt Angle. Um, this WrestleMania 21 is a little bit strange. And you see it's for the Xbox, so uh, the change for systems. And Legends of WrestleMania, if you are a hardcore fan of the Henry the Giant era, uh, maybe you are interested in that. If you are just a normal wrestling fan, you don't need that. And this is, um, we're talking about the Super NES WrestleMania Arcade, and this is the PC version. So, Raw, the flagship of the entertainment. And I put in the right numbers. Raw is interesting. I think it's decent enough to, to play them. Raw 2 is absolutely the better, the better sequel. Um, where some angles, you can do storylines, you can interfere matches, you can even interfere in a locker room, steal things, it's interesting, but it's not the greatest thing on the living planet. Uh, I change it. So, from Trish Status to Stacy Keebler just in a second. Um, Day of Reckoning is okay. It's a question if you have a GameCube, if you have a cube. Uh, I think we are acceptable, we have some nice ideas, we have some good storylines. It's okay, but it's not in the, the league of uh, today's games, of course. If you are an idiot, like me, you have also Royal Rumble for the Dreamcast and the All-Stars. 
All Stars has a very corny graphic style and I don't like it. Uh, the old versus new generation gimmick is, is very... Uh, no, it's not my thing. And this Royal Rumble, it has a Royal Rumble modus. The graphic is okay. Uh, the graphics are okay, but believe me, it's just an arcade mode with a Royal Rumble mode. That's enough. That's not enough. That's too less. So, and if talking to less, if you are an absolutely idiot and think of a WWE and uh, I think it was WWE, okay, it's official license, you see that. Uh, you have Crush Hour. Crush Hour is um, a destruction derby with wrestlers. Believe me, you don't need that at all. Uh, the sequel of uh, WrestleMania Arcane game is in your house and maybe I can... Uh, move it and you can see the logo. Um, it's the same thing, it's a little bit updated, better graphics, but it's the same arcade version. Very famous, um, you know, see, it's the Attitude Era, Warzone and Attitude from Acclaim. Very good wrestling games, very good. If you have a PlayStation 1 and you are a hardcore fan, these games are playable. You have a season mode. Here you have uh, some nice movies from the original wrestlers. It's very good. And then now coming to the famous, the SmackDown. Yeah, the Rock has arrived to SmackDown, and this is here games. Um, this is SmackDown One, SmackDown Two. SmackDown Two is very famous for its strange season modus, um, where you have to simulate uh, the the CPO games with a lot of time. Smackdown 3 is okay, shut your mouth is very acceptable, here comes the pain is considered also by me with the great Brock Lesnar, the great thing as one of the best wrestling games of all time. It's very good, it has a great story mode, great ideas. If you are a fan of wrestling, you have to get this. After the Smackdown series, you know, the brand extension nobody ever wanted. Smackdown vs. Raw. So, la 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 la, we can see it by the numbers. Da, 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 da. And if you are very fan, now you have the ECW! If everybody wanted this. Uh, da, 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 and this is the 11 installment. This series is um, very criticized as the FIFA of wrestling. Every year a new game with a little bit um, difference. It considered you have a general manager mode, you have a ECW, you have uh, better tag teams, you have better special matches. The series is good, but uh, from one year to another it was not so in revolution. Um, the greatest thing is, this is the reason why I got the PSP version of 2006, you need the PSP version to unlock Jake the Snake Roberts in 2006. Great merchandising. So, this was the rest of my wrestling games. Um, have a nice fun with WE12. It's a decent game, it's okay. See you next week. Bye bye.